The Retirement Halftime Show. Maintain your lead in retirement. You're watching the Retirement Halftime Show. I am your host, Alexander Joyce, and of course with us as usual, um, Alex Clark, our co-host. And um, I wanted to pick the topic today, right? Okay. And, and, and I think that um, we, get a, we get questions from our viewers, and I would always um, ask our viewers if there's something that um, interaction is good, right? Sure. So if there's something that um, you think others could relate to, maybe it's a story, maybe it's um, a common situation, maybe it's something we said um, on this show, or maybe it's something we said last show, and this show reminds you of what we said in the last show, um, give us a shout. I think that um, we always want to get people's questions answered. There's no other reason why someone would tune into a show like this if this if these topics were not top of mind. So I think that um, my topic today is uh, titled our tools. Okay. Right. What is in our our, our tool shed or toolbox per se? Because we live in a um, and I'm sure everybody can relate to this. We live in a day and time where technology is at an all-time high, right? I mean, I, I, you know, my kids are, I'm always telling them to go outside and ride your bike. I mean, they're, they're so in tune. They can probably use the iPad or the iPhone better than I can, right? So um, what is truly what to expect when we are in the process, if you would, of building a plan um, for anybody, right? So somebody comes in, um, we've, we've done, um, we've, we've, we've got a chance to know them. We've got some information. We've got some statements, if you would. Um, and we've got, we've, we're, we're in the beginning processes, process of, of building a plan. What are some of those steps that we, that we look at, Alex? Yeah, you really hit the nail on the head, Alex. You know, tools, right? You yep. can't build a house with just a hammer. Yeah. It won't work. Right. So it's, it's vitally important for us to have state-of-the-art tools, you know, Morningstar, things that we can help design plans where, as you mentioned in an earlier segment, stress test, sure. right? Those are important pieces. Uh, designing out through software, technology, ways that we can look at things holistically, not just a one-track mind. Okay, okay, okay. So, so one of the things that, um, I, because I hope that um, thus far in a lot of individuals watching the show are probably familiar with Morningstar and we have a lot of other pieces, right? A lot of, a lot of other tools, but I think probably a lot of people can relate to Morningstar. They've been around for a very long time. So um, <laughs> a lot of what Morningstar does, as you just mentioned, um, is look at things, the intricacies of what's inside of that portfolio or what's inside of a particular fund holistically, Correct. right? It breaks down. I mean, we, we, we certainly don't want to get into ratios and sharp ratios and peg ratios on a show like this. Um, it's just too much, right? People want to Absolutely. know what's in it for them. How can we help them, right? Are we a good fit for them, right? How can we relate to them, right? Do, we, do they like us, right? And, and I think that that's um, one of the things we want to take, that we want them to take away. But the other piece is, um, we have to leverage technology in our firm because this isn't the old school pin and a pad and and r turn over the recommendation, <laughs> right. right? Or as we mentioned before on a show like this, um, it's a mutual fund or it's an ETF or uh, I, you know everything is the same. And so we we look at something like Morningstar or we look at building a plan, look at looking at of course inflation and how inflation uh, takes a toll in the portfolio sure. or a projected rate of return, sure. um, how sequence of return can play a part in that projected rate of return. Being able to know how historical returns are gonna affect. Exactly right, looking at historical yeah, returns. Or if somebody says, hey, in five years into retirement, we wanna take a major withdrawal to buy an RV, a lake house, right. fund some grandkids' colleges, right? Being yeah. able to leverage that technology and show what that would look like yeah. I mean, that is, that is key. Yeah, because it is gonna affect the, the averages, if you will. Sure. Nothing goes in a straight line, right? Except for the last 10 years, <laughs> <laughs> right? So, but that's, that's the thing, right? Because people wanna know how RMDs are gonna affect the portfolio if they're taking out 4%, RMDs kicking at 3.5%, Social Security kicks in at 70, for her 66. You put that average return of 7% in there, how inflation over a period of time is gonna kick yeah. in. You need that income to come out. How is that gonna look in the next 25 or 30 years? Yeah, you're exactly right. People need that. Yes. And so uh, we, 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 and we talked about stress tests. We understand that there's going to be volatility over their lifetime. 
Yes. Right. We understand that the market's going to come up, the market's going to go down. There'll be some flat years, some great years, some bad years. And we want to understand how volatility over time is going to affect the overall returns as well. Yep. So we stress test the portfolio. Yep. We look at things like that. We look at what has happened historically, whether it's oil shocks or, or interest rate hikes. And we talked about these things. But we want to make sure that, um, again, expectations are managed. Their risk tolerance is in, in, in the forefront of our mind. Yep. Inflows or outflows are in there. They have a rock solid plan in retirement and they have peace of mind and we can review it over time. Yeah. Alex, great topic. Um, folks, if you have any questions about that, if you want more information about these topics, reach out to us, right? We love hearing from you. Until next time, stay tuned folks. The Retirement Halftime Show. Maintain your lead in retirement. There's some things in life we can always get back. Money, that's one of them. But time, that can never be replaced. Your kids, grandkids, they don't care how big your house is or the type of car you drive. The time they spend with you, that's what matters most. Allow us to help take your financial concerns away so you can enjoy the more important things in life. Call us today at 317-903-9157. Schedule a no-obligation visit and rejoice in your retirement. I'm Alexander Joyce, President, CEO of Rejoice Financial. Getting the education you need for a successful retirement is key. That's why I've written my second book, Rejoice in Your Retirement, Everything You Need to Know to Get Everything You Want. The book covers topics like identifying the income gaps, new ideas for investing, taxes and retirement, your legacy beyond dollars and cents, and much more. I've written this in an easy to understand format so that just about anyone can get the most out of it. To get a copy of Rejoice in Your Retirement, everything you need to know to get everything you want, you can go to Amazon. But if you're one of the first callers, you can get a complimentary signed copy of this book just by scheduling a no cost, no obligation visit. This book is packed with information that will help you get the most out of your retirement years. If you wanna know more about successful retirement strategies, then call now. Education is key. And let us help you rejoice in your retirement.